What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, John for the Gamer Dude here, welcoming you back to another episode of Persona 4 Golden. Uh, last episode, I was freaking out and being like, oh my god, what's gonna happen to this? And then I realized it's 7 9, which remember if I told you guys, if, I, if you guys remember what I said, that 7 9 was the last day. I totally left this going. Oh. Good. I totally left this going. And so, like, whoopsies. It's this. And I'm like, yeah, that's right. It's going to show that nothing happened. Uh, and that we're good. And that we're fine. And we did our job the way it was supposed to. So, good on us. Sad that I didn't think about that. But I didn't think about that. So, but yeah. So, there should be nothing on the screen, hopefully. Yep. No one is appearing on the mid channel. Since Risei has been rescued, it seems the killer was thwarted this time. Yeah, so. <clears throat> what I had expected, but what I failed to recognize until after I was freaking out. Fog is covering the town. Hmm. I must have missed something there. Uh, what exactly just, huh? Excuse me. You hear sirens in the distance. Distance, does something happen? Your cell phone is ringing. It's from Chie. Honestly, Chie, I saw that too. I heard about it. I, the what the heck? And whose male body was that? Like the thing is, is we know it's a male, so that's like mediocrely okay. So you're sh you're sure that you rescued Risei? It would be best you hurried to Genus. Yes, it would be. What the hell is happening? It is daytime now. Where's Yosuke and... Where's Yosuke? That's my first gut reaction. Why is Yosuke doing that? Yeah, it was murder, all right. The body was hanging upside down on an apartment's rooftop rail. But how could that... That's not all. The victim this time, it was Kimura. <sighs> Wait. We're gonna... I kind of enjoyed him, like, a lot, and we just killed him off. Like, yeah, I jokingly was like, oh my god, you're so annoying, blah blah blah, but like, I actually enjoyed him. Uh, uh. That's, that's rough. supposed to know but I talked to a guy there who saw it it's true there's no mistake are you serious that was the killer targeting people who get shown on TV I had never seen King moron on the midnight channel or any other programs Damn, where did this happen I thought we finally figured some things out was it all just a big coincidence Honestly, probably. I hate to say it, but that's a very high probability, Chie. Well, but maybe it does, and maybe that we're freaking out over a murder that. Well, no. I don't know. How, I don't have any way to really 
make you guys feel better. And I don't like that I don't have a way to make you guys feel better, but like, honestly, like, what could this be? I mean, yes, in a way, but it was something that we tried to do. But, I mean, I feel like it's, it's, it's really too early to give up. We don't even know if this is connected. We started this thing because the police can't tell their asses from their elbows. We give up now, and that shithead's gonna be on the loose forever. This ain't the time for bitching and moaning. We just gotta keep on keeping on. Where's he coming? Huh. Big talk from someone like you, Kanji. He did a lot of legwork. Where were you? I know. We're dealing with a murderer here, but we've all risked our lives to get this far. No way we'll back down. And we promised the bear, too. Hey, that's right. Maybe Teddy knows something about this. Honestly, Teddy would not be a bad answer to this question. Well, since moping around won't do us any good, let's go see him. Yes, let's, we need to go see Teddy. We need to figure out what's going on. Teddy's, Teddy's an important member of this party and this team. Oh, no. Something happened? Ah, yes, your grace. Great timing. Did the manager tell you anything about this? There's been this weird mascot around our department for quite a while now. Is there some kind of campaign on today? Mascot? He said his name was, um, what was it? Terry? Eddie? <laughs> Teddy's out of the TV? Well, there are no customers around, so I guess it's fine. I better get back to my station. Why is Teddy making his way out of the TV? Please don't tell me. Whoa, he's here. <laughs> he really, really hits the spot. Why why is he out of the TV? And how what the <laughs> He's like, I made it to the other world, you sickos. Teddy, are you okay on this side? How did you even leave your Of course I can come out. There's an exit. It just never occurred to me to do it before. But spending time with you all sparked my curiosity about this world. I did wonder if it was a good idea, but my feet started moving before. <laughs> so you, you let your body just make your movements instead of your brain. That makes sense. And when I thought about it, I had nowhere to go. And it was a waste to go back. So I waited here for you. Oh, someone asked for my name. So I told them, I'm Teddy. So that's why. Oh, no, there's something we need to ask you. How long have you been here, Teddy? Did anyone enter the other world? I stayed until the fog settled in on my side, but no one came. You're positive. You really didn't sense a single person. I just said that I didn't. I was there all by myself, like always. <laughs> Your nose wasn't clogged or anything? I believe you. Oh, my safe heart is breaking in your kindness. Well, it's true that the Midnight Channel was blank last night. And even before that, Teddy says he didn't sense anything, right? Does that mean King Moron was never on that side? What's going on? I, don't, I really don't think he does. He doesn't want to.
Oh, Reese hates orange glasses. <laughs> Today begins the new legend of Teddy. Wow, a new legend. Teddy has joined the group as a frontline fighter. He'll definitely be a strong asset in the battle against the shadows. Fool investigation team rank five. Where are we going? The floodplains, probably? No, that's probably. Okay, just to make sure, I'm gonna ask you one last time. Nobody was over there except for you until the fog came back, correct? That's what I've been saying. He didn't show up on the midnight channel either. What's up with that? No clue. Uh, regularly old murder. Which is which is good, um, kind of. Just means that there is a actual real murderer. Which, in our circumstance, circumstance we don't care about it for the police and for Dojima. He's going to be having heavy work. They never intended to. kill any more people by throwing them into TVs. I mean, we prevented his last three attempts in a row. Oh, I get you. That could be it. So they snuck someone on our side this time to make sure it worked. Yeah. If that's true, then we have no way of preventing more murders unless we catch the killer. We need more clues. I wonder if Reese has joined up and around yet. Probably. Yeah. We'll have to put our hopes on her. Ugh, it's so hot out. I'm taking this off. Teddy? I don't know if this is a good idea. Wait, you're not talking about your head, are you? Cut it out! There's still kids watching! Jeez, they'd be scarred for life if they see an empty mascot walking around. A little consideration, man. I'm glad you're back to normal, though. Your fur is all fuzzy again. Huh? Can I feel it? <laughs> That's a kanji. I mean, yeah, let's go for it. No. Bruh. Actually, I'm no longer a hollow bay. <laughs> I trained and trained, hoping that someday the door with Chin Chan and Yuki Chan, and now I finally have an inside. Yeah. Good job with that. <laughs> Dude, you're hollow. Taking your head off isn't gonna cool you down. But I just told you I'm not hollow anymore. It's too hot. I can't stand it. Teddy's cute, holy hell. Hey, Chie Chan, Yuki Chan. Yes? <laughs> They're floored. They're floored. Just like I am. They're floored. Do you have anything to wear? I'm basically like a newborn at the moment. Teddy? Is 
<laughs> Wait, did you say you're like a newborn? Then don't don't take the bottom part off. You need some clothes, right? Come on, let's go look around. Jack, Teddy. Don't worry, Kanji, I'm floored too. He said he's not hollow anymore. So, like, he threw himself a body in there? What kind of creature would do that? Again, this is hardly the first bizarre thing we've seen. Facts. And I gotta admit, it's probably better than him walking around in his bear suit. It's better than working in either bear suit, to be honest. Oh, hey, weren't we gonna see about talking to Risa? Yes, we were. I'm so shocked that I lost track of what we were talking about. Let's head over to Risa's place. Oh, fuck. Sorry, I skipped that. Oops. I'm, cl I'm, I'm, I'm ha hitting, hitting A a little bit more happily than I should. Damn, Teddy's hot. Finally, the season for topsicles again. Dude, how many are you going to eat? You're gonna get a stomach ache. Sorry, we're late. Why'd it take you that long to find clothes for Ted? How do I look? Damn. She's magnificent. Uh, don't encourage him. I have to say, he totally blew my mind. But he's Teddy, all right. This guy had to make it a huge ordeal. Everything was new to him, so it turned into a big mess. Okay, I'm not surprised. It is Teddy. And Teddy's kind of a perfectionist in a lot of ways. He was so excited in the women's section that he covered his blabber. Hey, you can't just go around doing whatever you please when you're in this form. Got it? Well, he can't help it. It's his first time in our world. <sighs> all right. You don't need to get all mopey like that. I never said I won't forgive you. I'm so glad. I was worried that you didn't like me anymore. <laughs> Man, if you can behave yourself, you'll be pretty cute. <laughs> what do you think, Kanji? Oh, you little ass. Huh? What are you asking me for? <laughs> well, I was just wondering if he was your type. Oh, I get it. What you're really asking is, will you please beat the shit out of <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's basically what he's asking. <laughs> he's kind of being an ass. <laughs> Yukiko's always, like, got the same wavelength as I do. <laughs> I love it. It ain't funny, Yukiko Senpai. <laughs> no. Your reaction is not the most. It's. You're. <laughs> It's not you. We're laughing at the idiocracy of Diosuke. It's fine. Sorry. <laughs> You'll have to forgive Yukiko. She's helpless when she gets this way. Oh, please, everyone. Don't fight over me, baby. Shut up. You picking a fight with me? You could go hand a thousand yen bill to Kanji. Here, Kanji. Get whatever ice cream you want. Just share it with Teddy. Oh, no. You're going to head for the token shop. Wait here until we get back. Wow. You're rich. I can't just take this from you. Think of it as a welcome back party for Teddy. Just don't go around making a racket. <laughs> yeah, honestly. <laughs> oh, you might say differently, but you're still nice to Teddy. I'm glad Yosuke is developing into such a mature adult. Someone who doesn't let trifles bother him. What? You're worrying me, 
Gucci, eh? Oh, it's about Teddy's clothes, that's all. We didn't have the money for them, so we charged the rest to you. That makes up for the lake. What else are we supposed to do? That stuff was expensive, even for Gunette. You seriously charged it to me? <laughs> you <laughs> Why would you do that? You know I just bought a motorcycle, I'm broke. <laughs> you know, if you're already broke, a little more debt isn't gonna make much of a difference. What? Come on, baby. Stop fighting over Teddy ran right into the street. Let's not do that, Teddy. <laughs> Don't do that. You know what? A section with just you and I? I'm down. You could go. yourself with Risa Kujikawa now? Why did the cook even let them charge it to someone else? Cook? Wait, you're that guy we saw with Clint. Precisely. I don't believe we've met since then. In fact, I don't believe I've ever introduced myself. My name is Naoto Shiragane. Naoto? I'm investigating the multiple murders that have occurred here. Oh, he's that a detective everybody's or that Dojima's got drunk over. I mean, it's not his fault, and I don't have any true feelings on him yet, and don't have a true reading. I honestly, I'm curious. Mind if I ask you a few questions on the subject? The latest victim, Mishiro Muraoka. He was a teacher at the school you all attend, correct? So what? The public is focused on the fact that he is associated with the second victim's school. But in truth, that's irrelevant. What intrigues me is the inconsistency. This Moraoka has never appeared on television. What do you make of that? How are we supposed to know? Well, we'll leave it at that. Now, though. For my part, solve this case as quickly as possible. I'll be keeping an eye on you all. Now then, until we meet again. Who is that guy? He felt like he completely saw through us. He even knew about the TV thing. Oh, what's Risa? Here to check up on me? Oh, yeah. Oh, um, do you guys have a moment? There's something I want to tell you. Follow me. My grandma's taking care of the shop today. Huh? Sure, okay. The Tatsume Shrine. On the store. I met this weird kid named Naoto a second ago. Oh, he's come to the shop several times. He asked me a lot about the incident. I didn't tell him anything about the other world there. I figured it'd be a waste of time. Actually, he asked me a 
about you guys too, but I just made up some stuff. Like, they found me unconscious on the roof of Janice. Well, I guess that's close enough to the truth. Um, so... Hmm? What's up? Um, I really appreciate what you did for me. Thank you so much! I love you guys! Huh? Um, you don't have to thank us. Josuke, <laughs> stop! I guess it sounds more natural this way to the public. I'm sorry. I've practically lost touch with what the normal me is like. <laughs> no need to apologize. Just do what comes naturally. I think everyone has multiple sides to them. You don't have to force yourself to decide on just one. <laughs> sounds convincing when Yukiko says it. Huh? It, really? You're the first people I got to know here. Oh, yeah, we almost forgot your present. The teddy glasses. Um, you don't have to take them, but... Well... Teddy gave you a pair of glasses to hold on to for when Risei joined you. But what should you say when giving them to her? Senpai, I was really struggling and got no help. I can help you in that world, right? With my power. So wouldn't it be better if I joined the team? He handed the glasses to Rise. These are kind of like proof that you're one of us. You explain the effect of the glasses to Rise. I see. I do remember you all wearing glasses over there. Thanks, Senpai. Now I'm part of the team too. Rise Kujikawa joined the group. She'll definitely be a strong asset in solving the case. I was right! Okay. I had initial thought processes that because we saved both of them, that our rank would go up to six. And it, it sure as heck did. So, <laughs> that's good. I'll be going to Yasudami High starting tomorrow. But I don't have any friends yet, so don't ignore me, alright? Well, hopefully we won't have to do that. Got it. Settled then. I'm counting on you. This sure is a rough time to transfer here, though. Kidnappings, morons death. All that and exams are soon due. No, I knew they were. I didn't want you to say it. Exams. Now I'm depressing myself. I wonder if there's any chance they'll be canceled. No, there won't be. Unfortunate, but they won't. <laughs> Good. Alrighty then. Let's discuss the case some more tomorrow at our special headquarters. Yo, how's it going? It's going, Kanji. I like to know how much a boy can eat. I don't know how that's going to work out, and if Teddy's going to stay, and if there's going to be Teddy form and not Teddy form. Not sure. Good evening. This is Nightline News. Our top story for the night concerns the latest development in an ongoing story. The serial murder case in Inima has claimed a third victim. The news shocked local residents who have not seen another murder in three months and assumed the spree had reached its end. The deceased since his body was found arranged in a similar manner as the last two victims, 
King Moron's picture is on the news. It seems he really was murdered. That's my homeroom teacher. Yeah, it was my homeroom teacher, and as much as everybody hated him, I kind of enjoyed him. I actually, funny enough, had that happen in real life. There, there was a teacher that everybody just was mad at and didn't like, and gave really, it was middle school, not high school, but uh, everybody was like, oh, I have Mr. Franklin, and blah, 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 with Mr. Franklin, and blah, 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 and everybody hated him, and I enjoyed him, and literally... We would, <laughs> there was a couple times where I'd be almost late to my next class because I would sit there talking. And, you know, a lot of people would say that I, I was a teacher's pet, right? And then I would, like, because I would talk to these teachers and I would want to know stuff from them, like how they are and what they do. And funny enough, two of my favorite teachers were from the same subject. And even if I didn't particularly like the subject as much, I was more of a math kid. So, but this was um, world histories and social studies and um, the other one that I liked and enjoyed a lot was, uh, civics, so both kind of in the same realm, but it's very interesting. I mean, funny enough, even the sub in that realm I liked a good amount, too, but yeah, like, not a lot of people like that teacher, and I was like, I can't, I don't understand why. Like, yeah, he's a, like, he's a harsher grader, and he isn't necessarily the easy A, but you actually learn from his class and you do stuff. Anyways, that kind of is my relation to that because, and the reason why is I think about it and I'm like, well, every time you go into have these like annoying lectures with this teacher, you get knowledge, right? And you're actually learning. That's Isn't that their job to teach you? Sorry, <laughs> that, was, that was a ramble. It's fine, Nautico. I'm here with you. It's fine. Your understanding has increased. Nanako seems somewhat relieved. It'll probably be Nato or Nyoto. News was livelier than usual. Yeah, it's okay, Nanako. Maybe you should try another magic trick. You move the finger on your right hand. To your left hand. This time you move the finger... The f move a finger on the left hand to your right hand. Nanako seems to have cheered up. Well, that's good. We need to make sure Nanako's okay. So, large scale investigation, huh? Oh, hi. This place. I mean, not really. It's been two days, but what's two days, right? It seems you've been called to the velvet room. I guess this is the first time in a while we've been called to the room, but... Yes. Yes, I think we are. The season has changed, but your future is not yet closed. In time, a path will open to you. Our true reason for calling you here tonight is to provide a new form of assistance to help you achieve just that. You dreamt of Sinus. Have you been 
using our services diligently? I would say so. The aid we will henceforth provide is an advanced form of leisure. Oh. I speak of the kind which means four or more precise times. Oh boy. A new type of fusion is available. A pretty much a, a, is climax. We're not that close, are we? Monday the 11th. That was a very, very big day. Yo. Hi, Yosuke. I still can't believe our homer teacher was killed. I couldn't get much sleep yesterday. How about you? Are you alright? Honestly, I'm a little depressed, to be fair. My homer teacher died. I actually liked him. A lot of people didn't like him. That's just natural. Anyone would feel that way. But does that mean that we're going to get a new homeroom teacher? I wonder who it'll be. Well, I'm pretty sure they won't be able to find anyone worse than King Moron. <sighs> well, that didn't help. Because I'm sad because of the fact that we lost him and don't really want a replacement. I want him back. Classroom is bustling. That's not how that works. Good morning. Mrs. Kashiwagi. I'm Noriko Kashiwagi, your new class teacher starting today. I have some sneaky suspicions, and I feel wrong for them. I won't say them out loud, but my brain definitely just went somewhere that is not the most PC. You all probably know already, but now that Mr. Motooka has passed away, I'll be taking good care of you instead. <laughs> okay. Why don't we start off with a moment of silence for Mr. Motooka? Close your eyes, everyone. That should be enough. I'll do my best to fill Mr. Motooka's shoes. So, our regular exams are still on track for next week. As your principal said, it's times like these when the schedule is most important, Nori-chan. Mrs. Kajawachi is ranting on and on. You hear classmates gossiping. Serious. The reception was bad, but, but it was getting to the good part. 
dreaming. The rumor about the midnight shaman is spreading further. We'd better wrap this case up quick. Anyways, let's meet up later. Don't make any plans for this afternoon. Fine. Uh, also, there's a student literally right there for you ta talking about that. So that's great. Love that you are terrible at doing things in confidence. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> okay, gee. That was funny. It's been a while since I failed in this subject. Yeah. If by a while you mean all the time. Shut up! Have you ever seen my score? I mean, we we have, but okay. The GA always has above average marks in their subjects so she doesn't fail. Yeah. But didn't you say it's people who get famous on TV who are targeted? Not necessarily famous, but who are on TV. I mean, she does. <laughs> Twitter's a great example of that form of logic. But with King Moron, he didn't appear on the Midnight Channel or the regular TV. Uh, I don't get this at all. Two victims in a row from our school. That's got to set off the police's alarm bells. We're not going to leave any stones at school unturned. No. <sighs> Info, right? Why run right here and spill it? You're 
Kenyan Estonian Chicken Asta Fauci at least had the nerve Just as long as it ends You don't deny then that you have involved yourselves in the matter? Well no matter I have no reason to say anything to you A game? Aren't you the one who thinks of this as a game? Detectives normally aren't involved with arrests, and we never harbor any special emotions regarding a case, either. Still, it is rather unfortunate that people are only attentive so long as our services are required. But then, I'm accustomed to it. Much about this case was perplexing, but its solution was surprisingly simple. Well then, I'll be going now. <laughs> yep. He said they have a suspect. But is this really going to solve everything? I don't think so, Chie. Who knows? I think they're talking about like I said, I think that they're disconnected. Welcome back. Hi, Nautico. No, we should increase our expression more for Dojima. I'm sorry, Nanako, but we have to. We need Dojima. We need Daddy Dojima. Do you realize you haven't brought anything from the house shopping program this week? Maybe you should watch it. We don't have money, though. I don't think, anyway. No, 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 no. We have 5,000 yen. I mean, it's a little bit, but... We have blessed hands and two giant candies for 39k yen. Growth two and a hell magatama for 24,000 yen. We don't have the money. I want to increase our expression. You said to work on translating. Expression increased. We are touching now. Okay, so we got we, we got what we needed. Okay, cool. You encounter a sentence that seems that to have been written for a child. Write it as a child would. The writing of the lines in child speech patterns turn out to be fun. Your pace is increased and your pen won't stop moving. You obtained 12k yen for your translating job. Nice. We needed that. That was a nice boost. You overhear students talking. Finals start next week. <sighs> Sepa, you look pretty down. That's not good for you, you know. Once they're over, summer vacation isn't far behind, right? 
Shut it, you puny underclassman. I have to study for my college entrance exams. You're, once you're a third year student, you'll get a taste of what it's like to take tests all year. <sighs> so we have finals next week. Obviously, we need that. But. Oh, did I go to after? Oh, no. Remember, guys, the finals are starting next week, and if you fail, you have to attend a lovely summer school. Anyways, today we're going to turn or talk about sex linkage. Sex linkage inheritance is dependent on the allosomes. To say it simply, it's genetic inheritance that caused by, that's caused by whatever decides if you are male or female. An example of is calico cats. Calico cats are almost entirely female. Not that there aren't any boys, but apparently there's only one out of every several tens of thousands. Maybe their rare male calicos are only popular with the ladies. <laughs> you listen to the lecture intently. You gained knowledge. I mean, she gave us knowledge about the calico cats and being one in tens of thousands. Class has ended today. You suspect... You suspect... The suspect has been added to the wanted list. Who's the criminal? You have no choice but to wait until more progress is made on the investigation. You want a charmed veil. I think you can get an adult atmosphere. Okay, so this is this is more quests for um, stuff for me to go do later on. But it's Tuesday. Maybe bands available today. What? Uh, not Ananya? Uh, what's wrong? It's almost time for the tests. I wish we still had a practice. <gasps> no. Not much to do. Tests before the tests without practice, huh? Uh, we don't have things we can do. That's kind of sad. It's raining. I guess we can go to Aya. Yukiko probably doesn't want to hang out. Wait, um, yes, let's do that, actually. I, I say as I'm thinking about Kanji, and wondering if Kanji may be available. Kanji is not. I'm, I mean, I'm thinking Yukiko, obviously, is the answer here, but we'll still go to Junus and check on Adachi and see if he's available. Ooh, he's available to hang out. Oh, it's you. Good timing. You want to hang out and talk for a while? That's way it looks like I'm more on a strike that, okay? Seems Adachi is slacking off. I feel the relationship will become closer soon. You want to spend the afternoon with Adachi? Sure. Good for you. You're a good listener, the kind who gets promoted. Adachi's acting, mis smiling mischievously. What are you doing? Shopping for dinner? I'm, I'm impressed. I live alone, so taking care... Dinner is freaking pretty tedious. Why? I guess a high school kid wouldn't get it. I just, I'm tired after work. So I make up a cup of ramen or something. That just doesn't seem to lead a nutritionally balanced life. Want me to make you a dinner? Like, you'd come over to my house? Of course, I'd you. <laughs> that would be interesting. But I'd prefer a girl to come over. Dachi smiling softly. Cute girls are the best, though. I go for the real knockouts myself. The most important thing is that they should be good cooks. Everything else, I can take or leave. Torchon, is that you? Shit, she found me. Are you off work? I hope you're not doing anything dangerous. 
No, no, I'm still on the clock. I was just on my way back to the station. I'm so happy to see you working hard. I brag about you to my neighbors all the time. I'll bring you some Nimino, okay? Have You have to take care of yourself. By the way, I saw this detective show on the TV the other day. This old woman seems like she'll be talking to him for a long time. Um, I need to get back. Oh, is it that time already? I hope your day goes well then. Finally. I guess her son has the same name as me. Maybe that's why she's been hanging around me ever since she found out. I don't know. She's always had a huge heaps of that Nimmo at the station. And she'll talk your ear off and let you hear. It's rather annoying. That does kind of sound annoying. Doesn't it? It's like she's practically like that practically every day. Adachi sighs. She's the exact opposite of my parents. So I can't relate to people like that. She's lonely, I guess. I don't think she has any relatives. I can't just ignore her either. It's part of my job. The police have been busy lately, so I'm the only one that can deal with her. Despite his griping, Adachi looks happy. I feel like you have seen a new side of Adachi. We are now rank 2 with Adachi. Kind of feel bad for not studying with Yukiko, because I feel like Yukiko studying would have been a great idea. The Toru Adachi social link has reached level 2. The power to create gestures have grown. Though I wish I shared her grandson name, name with a grandson instead. I'm still on 27 after all. So 27. The prime age. Cool. Well, I'm going to head to back or Dojima so Sean will really chew me out. See ya. You watched Adachi go back to work and then went home. And then pretended to chat with Nanako, but nope, it didn't actually. Well, I mean, we kind of did. Oh. Exams start on Tuesday next week. Study? Probably. First, let's harvest the vegetables in the garden. What seedling? Barrier corn. So what is the... Red paprika, white paprika, blue paprika, green paprika. Oh! They give um, resistances. They're like free red walls. Cool. And Nanako is available. So I'm going to go ahead and talk to her today. Even though our Arcana is not necessarily ready to um, go up yet. I think Nanako is a good idea. And exams start on 719, so... That is rather scary, but we live, we deal. I'm sorry. sorry, it's an emergency. You can go found yourself under your umbrella. Thank you. Whew, thank you, I couldn't find my folding umbrella. It's odd because... I always have it one in my bag. Oh, I did use it when I was with Chie. Um, oh, so sorry. I didn't mean to intrude. Now, I'm a little nervous. What if people start to talk? That's fine with me. Really? If it's alright with you, I guess I'm fine with it too. I'm really not, but that's fine. I hope it stops raining by the time school gets out. Oh, you seem really sad. I know it's tough. I still can't breathe. I still can't breathe. Mr. Morocco was taken from us. Faculty, uh, The faculty office is shook, too. But we can't sob about it all day. Today, we're going to get the physical back in education. We're going to play rugby. I don't even think I'll, about getting lazy because it's hot. It's hot. It's hot. But run. Keep running. Sweat. 
and then eat shaved ice afterwards because the shaved ice you eat after exercise is best. Brains freeze? Ah, oh, yeah. You seem cool. Morigoto. Morigoto, answer me while running. What is the medical term for brain freeze? Nero... N Nero capillary constriction. Wrong! It's actually... Sphenopalatine ganglionergia. Wow. Pfft. Yeah, I would never guess that. When you eat something cold, like shaved ice, it constricts the flesh around the th the trimal or trigemal nerve. Then the nerve it tells your brain that your forehead hurts. So you think your forehead hurts. All right, I can see you all sweating hard. It's the more you sweat, the better the shaved ice will be when you're done. Your answer was wrong, because we've literally only gotten PE questions wrong, and continue to only get PE questions wrong. Yes, hype. <laughs> well, that's literally the only subject we've gotten wrong on a continual basis, but whatever. Who's available on this random Wednesday? Nobody said they were. Which actually scares me. Dun 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 dun. Okay, Yukiko, if you're available to study today, today would be fine. You're probably not, though. Oh, you are. Oh, hi. You feel you could be closer, but our relationship is not ready to advance with Yukiko. But that's okay. Practice building. So Wednesday, is, is Kanji available? And if so, he could be. Senpai. I've got something to ask you, man to man. Can can you tutor me? Um, uh, you know what? <sighs> Sigh, me. Ma's gonna put me through the wall if she sees my test scores. I know Kanji, but. I don't know if studying together is the best idea. It'll increase our knowledge, probably, but I don't know, and I don't want to take the chance. <sighs> but Adachi's probably not slacking off either. It's Wednesday, so it's not like I don't have anything. I don't have anything going on. It's like, do I really have excuses not to talk to him? No. Literally, my only excuse would be Adachi, who's probably not even available. Oh, oh we meet again. Me. I was in the shopping for dinner. The cabbage was cheap, so I bought it without thinking. But how do you cook cabbage? I think I might be eating it. It for a while and I don't have time to cook seriously these days what's with how busy I am oh well okay let's get some more oh we, we don't know what the wall or the we'll still get paprika we'll get both You know what? Yeah, we're going to study with Ko uh, Kanji. I don't know what that's going to do, but if that gets me experience or uh, knowledge because I'm doing that with Kanji and with somebody else, that's probably what I want to do, right? As much as hanging out with you will advance my persona level with her, let's go ahead and study. Yeah. Great. Now Ma won't. Huh. You didn't hear anything. Yasugame High Library. You're studied with kanji. I get nervous in libraries. If I got a squeeze, I, or I got a sneeze, I should I hold it in? Well, anyways, let's go over uh, everything. By teaching kanji, you were able to review the material for yourself. Your knowledge has greatly increased. You bonded with your study partner by studying together. Since you have completed the expert study methods, you were able to study more efficiently. You gained more knowledge. You feel like your relationship is going to become closer to... We fucking should have studied with... <laughs> ah, I should have studied with Yukiko. That would have been nice. You can work as a hospital janitor today. No, we're talking to Dojima. Dojima's bustling the newspaper pages. Come to think of it, Dojima was looking at a copy of the newspaper article. It seemed important, but what happened to it? With your current level of expression, you might be able to get something out of him. You, since it, you're with you, since you have the unicorn persona, the hero fan, you two might get along well. You feel like your relationship is going to come closer soon. Do you want to spend time with Dojima? Yes, we do. You're that bored. Have a seat. 
I am still not done scathing you after what you did, but I'm kind of starting to get over it a little bit. The newspaper article. Oh, yeah. yeah I, I, I found it. Were you worried about it? Uh, it was about Chisato, my wife, when she was killed by a hit and run. Uh, I told you before, right, about the case where we never had a suspect. Get it now. There's nothing more that I can say about it in this house. Let's stop there. Then let's go outside, Dojima. We really need to talk about this. <laughs> you win. Dojima sighs. She... Nanako's mother was run over on her way to pick up Nanako from the nursery school. It was a cold day, and there were no witnesses, so they didn't find her until much later. Until they got word to me, Nanako was waiting all that time at the nursery, all alone. Waiting for her mother, who had never come. I couldn't tell Nanako that her mother was killed. That's... Her father, whose job is to catch criminals, couldn't find a single lead. But I haven't given up. I'll catch the guy. I don't need a private life to do that. Nanika will understand. Are you sure this is what she wants? Even if it's not what she wants now, she'll understand someday. I have to tell myself that. Dojima looks exhausted. Sorry. Sorry. Leave me alone for now. You know, Hagrid. Thank you. Of course, Dojima. You can sense Dojima's pain. Dojima Social Link has reached level 6. You left Dojima in the living room and went to your room. I mean, he did tell us a lot. And you know, that was good of him to do, but... I wish that he would have told us about that a lot sooner. And transitioning to school. <laughs> I'm sure you all feel anxious knowing your homeroom teacher is deceased. Well, to be honest, us teachers are kind of afraid of ourselves. The culprit is still on the loose, but there's no sense in wasting time money about it. Let's get to work. Today, we'll finish, we'll talk about Kabo Dashi, or Kuaki. First, look at this kanji. Hey, Hoshikan, isn't that a misprint in the textbook? It's supposed to be, whatever that mark means. Ha, huh, good eye, but no. This is wrong. Or this is the wrong kanji, but the book's supposed to print this way. It's actually quoting him. Hagrichan, quit staring at the puppet and pay attention to the book. Which famous Han, Han, Harry, and Aaron Monk famously used the wrong version of the whatever kanji? Kuake. Yep, that's right. It was Kuake. So you're listening after all. There's some old saying, even Kubu made mistakes in writing. Ku Kobo is another name for Kuake. And this was a mistake he made. This happened out happened when he wrote the name Atonman on the frame in the Oton gates in the city of the Kayo. But this it it wasn't until after they put the frame up in that he noticed that he missed the dot on the top of the whatever this kanji is. <laughs> it's actually bothering me that I don't know what it is. If somebody knows what it is, please tell me in the comments below, because it's actually kinda of bothering me that I don't. Instead of taking the entire thing down and redo it, he added the dot by throwing his calligraphy brush at the gate. But by the way, my wife made this doll for that my to be my hand. Don't think she did a great job. Don't you think she did a great job making it look like me? You give the correct answer. Your knowledge has increased. <sighs> That's good. Lunchtime. So social link showdown time. It's Thursday. So oh, we got kanji.
Got to decide later, Kanji, but but more than likely, yes. Kanji's our only dude. Okay. Like, like I said, more than likely it was going to be Kanji, and I was like, I was like 99.9% .9 sure that Kanji, it was going to be Kanji, but you never know. Why are they not able to hang out? Oh, club activities are closed because of the test. Duh. Also, Yosuke could have. Yosuke could have hung out and he didn't say anything to me, which kind of makes me mad too. GA might be available too, but I gotta I gotta boost up with Kanji. Yeah. Kanji looks very happy. You want to stop by my place? Ma said she wanted to meet you. Oh, I'm glad. I'm glad you talked to your mother about me, because that's usually a pretty good sign in a relationship. I feel like if you're able to talk to your parents about this, about you, like that's always a good thing. I talk to my parents about like a lot of the friends that I have and if you're like an actual friend then you've been mentioned in more in-depth conversations with my parents just saying so so you know um joy <laughs> specifically in a lot of good ways so if she ever made her way down here they would really want to meet joy in person so he might have some high expectations there, miss, but it's fine. It's okay. Senpai. Gotta warn you, there's nothing fun here. I mean, you're here, and you're fun. Hey, Ma, I'm home. She ain't here. What's she doing leaving the store open? Aya owner. Kanji Khan, are you there? Your mother is in the hospital. The Let's hurry, we gotta go. Huh? Kanji, you don't know this, but there's some like women that at night shift who's like super predatory we gotta go now before and it's a thursday so she's gonna be working today we have to go yeah i need to go let's see yes i only heard from a customer but she's at inaba municipal hospital let's go yeah. yes sir we should yes let's go let's run kanji Ma, are you all right? Were you taken to the hospital? Someone do this to you? Goodness, but you look pale. Never mind me. What about you? Huh? Are you you're okay? I wasn't taken to the hospital. I took someone. The poor thing got hit by a bicycle right in front of our shop. He hit his head, so I had a doctor examine him. He said there's no damage, thank goodness. The one who hit him was a boy from your school. When he saw the po poor child fa fall, he ran right away. Why don't you find him and give him a little scolding? Cut the crap. You have no idea how I felt. <laughs> I'm fine, Kanji. Your mother isn't kicking the bucket that easily, you know. It's not like you get, not like you to get so worried over such a little thing. Shut up, you old cow. <laughs> well, don't worry about him. He's looks like it was no big deal after all. I mean, I don't blame you. Yeah, if it's not just me, then I guess it's okay. Kanji looks a little embarrassed. I thought I'd face all of my bad parts back out there. 
but not everything can change like that, huh? I've been by myself. I might have been even more scared. <laughs> I hope I can repay the favor. Seems like you were able to support Kanji. He said, said you sensed his trust in you. Kanji, rank three. <sighs> Kanji is now able to pick up fallen people. Oh no, this is the follow-up follow attacks. I'm going home. Don't blame you. That boy. We were going home. He didn't have to run away like that. Oh, you're Haggard Coon. You came to our store with Yuka-chan, right? I've been hearing a lot about you from Kanji. Senpai this and Senpai that. He must really like you. I'm sorry you made he made or sorry to have made you both come all this way here. He hates hospitals, you see. His father, my husband, died here. Kanji happened to be somewhere else when he collapsed, so I think he's, he was scared today. Ah, but it's good to see you. He's always had trouble getting along with people. He didn't have any friends like you before. Because of his looks, question mark? No, he was so cute when he was young. When he... When was it? He began to wear scary clothes like that. He would always rather play house instead of catch or go home, go to home act instead of PE. He never did any, had any male friends, but the girls didn't accept him either. After a while, he started getting into fights every day and bleaching his hair and... I was worried about him, but lately he seems to be having fun, so please take good care of him. You feel you like you understand Kanji a little bit more. You parted with Kanji's mother and went home. It is now evening time. So we could work at the janitor's office. Nanako probably would be able to... No, it's Nanako is not ready to advance. Let's make some food. Surprisingly... You have ingredients to make fried chicken. You decided to make fried chicken. You marinated the meat. What should you cover the chicken with? Um, let's go with rice. Uh, rice flour. This t the taste is awful. This doesn't seem edible. You said to throw it away. Well, that's rough. All right, let that be a lesson about the Mariana Islands. Let's take a breather and talk about something fun. The Mariana Islands are in an area of the ocean where typhoons are born. There's a line on the map that typhoons ne can never cross. Let's see, Haggard Coon, you've been you've blended into the class a little too well. Which line can a typhoon never cross?
Um, the Prime Meridian? I'm like, the Equator? I feel like it could be able to, to, to do, right? Like, the Equator f feels wrong. Like, you could... I mean, but maybe the international date line. That just sounds funny. And the prime meridian. You know what? I'm going to go for the funny answer. But I think the equator is the right one. But I'm going to go for the funny one. Because I feel like that might be funny. That's not it. It was the equator. I was right. Typhoons move globally by global air currents called atmospheric, atmospheric circulation. If if one forms in the northern hemisphere, it moves north, and from if it forms in the south, it moves south. That's why it never it can't cross the cross the equator. Isn't that interesting? Make sure you tell your parents that I'm an interesting teacher. Okay, feedback like that can affect my paycheck. <laughs> Just kidding. Let's continue the lesson. Well, I mean, I was right. I said I feel like the equator is right, but I'm going to go for the funny answer. So I still am going to count that as correct. Even though the game won't, I'm still going to count it as correct. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully you have a wonderful, wonderful day. I love you all. Bye!